Hey, so like, can I get like every movie starting with like the letter H? And also my roommate locked me out, so just give me my lockout key. You're the most unintelligent human being I've ever had the pleasure of being around. Adios, lunatic. Hey, so like, can I get every movie starting with the letter H? And also my roommate locked me out, so can you just give me my lockout key? Oh, okay. Can I get you your lockout key first and then have you go back to your room and come back down before you get out a movie? Yeah, I guess that works. Okay. Can you be back in five minutes? Fine. Okay. So, Billy, you said that Garrison was on a downward spiral like Lindsay Lohan. Yeah. Well, you know, it's actually a huge compliment because she's like one of the greatest icons. So, Billy, you said that Garrison was on a downward spiral like Lindsay Lohan. Okay, I'm sorry. You had to forgive me for saying that. I'm sorry, Garrison. I didn't really mean it. Like, I was just, like, really angry at the time, and so that's what came out. But I'm sorry. Don't don't take any offense to it. No, it's it's okay. I mean, I know what you're saying. I do have a couple mug shots and some spiraling I've been going through. But, yeah, I will work on it. All right. Thanks. <laughs> Can you just not? Oh my god, give me your ID! Can you just chill out? Oh, chill out, buddy. I am so relaxed right now. Oh, I'm calm and cool like a whistle. Hey, can I see your ID? Thank you. Can I see your ID? Thank you. Can I see your ID? Can I just not show you my ID? No, I know, I know, I know you, but it's policy. I gotta, I had to see your ID anyway. Really? Yeah, I'm sorry. Just, can I see your ID, please? I don't have it, man. All right. Well, you're gonna have to call in a friend to let you in the building have to sign you in. Fine. I know, policy is policy, though. Here, why don't you just wait over there for a little bit, okay? Yeah. Can I see your ID? Thank you. See your ID? Thank you. We're so, We're so close. close. We're, We're like, like signing these cats. Flawless, what's up? Flawless, run around that flawless. What's on that flawless? Right. Zombies, my dog. So this is winter closing, you gotta do it, it's, it's dumb, but whatever. So basically we're gonna key in, you knock first, all right, all right, just like that. Keying in. We go in, we look for anything illegal, and we confiscate it. Yeah. You got me? Do you got me? I'm prepared. Ta eyes of the tiger. Okay. Let's go. Good. Oh my god! My blood type is Pinot Grigio. You got Valium's my favorite color! Oh my god, yes. Let's just what? get right into no, this. No, no, no. Right. We have to confiscate it. <laughs> I'll confiscate it, alright. Don't worry about that. <laughs> alright, so this is winter closing. I know it's your first yes. year. Um, before we go, we knock. Make sure no one's there. Alright! 
we don't hear about that. We key in. Okay. We go in. We look for anything illegal. We confiscate it, and we report it. Yeah. Okay. Right? Yeah. Okay. yeah. Check around the room. Everything up? Uh, no, not everything. Okay. All right. So what we gotta do is we have to report these and get they those. Need, they need curls. receipts too, right? Yep. We can get that at the front receipt. desk. Okay. Okay. Then we'll contact the hall director. All right. Okay. Well, this is yeah. first time, right? Perfect. Okay, so guys, tell me what's been going on. What's happening with you? So, I feel like my roommate doesn't want to hang out with me anymore. I don't know if he wants to be me or skin me and wear me like last year's Versace. Versace is fabulous. <laughs> okay! I feel like my roommate doesn't want to hang out with me anymore. I don't know if he wants to be me or skin me and wear me like last year's Versace. Okay, so let's try to get to the bottom of this. Do you think that something's been happening lately? Like, what's going on? Why do you feel like he doesn't want to hang out with you anymore? broke the bowl off my cake and ate it, so I think that's a toast love. Craig, this is the second time he's interrupted. That so I don't give a shit attitude isn't gonna cut it anymore. I'm tired of your lazy shit, bitch! Ah! <laughs> I wanted to hit him for a long time. Glad I did it. <laughs> That I don't give a shit attitude isn't gonna cut anymore. You're a lazy bitch! Well, I think we both said some things that we don't necessarily mean, so let's just we can talk about this after staff meeting. So Tori, thanks for coming in today. Um, you know, I'm gonna be really direct and honest with you. You got some you got some not too favorable feedback. Um, why don't you go ahead and kind of take a look at it and let me know your your thoughts. You're never going to be Angelina Jolie, Tori? How rude. When people tell me I'm fake, they're just pulling my leg. Uh, hey, Tori, thanks for coming in today. Um, got your feedback, and some of it's not very favorable, but I'm going to give it to you directly and kind of let me know what your thoughts are after reading it, okay? Okay. You're never going to be Angelina Jolie, Tori? It was so hurtful. Why would someone say that? I tried so hard. <sighs> she hurted me for no reason. Don't hate me because I have it all. Hate me because I'm beautiful. Happiness is never having to apologize for being you. Get your shit together, Gabby. She hurted me for no reason. Don't hate me because I have it all. Hate me because I'm beautiful. Okay, guys, I think that it's best if we schedule an appointment together because I value both your opinions, but I really would like to have a sit down. Is that okay? Thank you. Okay. One sec. 
Hey, there's a program in the lounge. It's a gold party, but of course I'm the only one wearing gold. Can I be judged? Probably. I'm young. I'm beautiful. I'm fabulous. Hey, there's a party in the lounge. I think uh, I think you'd be really interested. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Am I gonna be judged? Probably. I'm young. I'm gorgeous. And I'm fabulous. Hey, thanks for coming into your one-on-one. -on -one. Yeah, I've been uh, really worried about you lately. Is everything all right? Because uh, it just looks you're really burned out. So much going on, and there hasn't been a lot of attention to detail in your work. So, what's up? My tank is full, and I'm driving into my future. Hey, thanks for coming into your one-on-one. -on -one. Um, I've really been kind of concerned lately. I've noticed you've been kind of really overloaded with a lot of obligations, and there hasn't been a lot of attention to the detail in your work. Is everything okay? Yeah, I've uh, just got a lot of stuff on my plate, but um, I'm managing. Oh, great. Well, how about we uh, you help fill up your tank and help you drive into your future?